Welcome back to the Best PT Podcast. This is episode 2.7, discussing myotomes. Regarding myotomes, Asia is the scale that is used on the MPTE. So whatever other scale you've been taught in school, Asia is the scale that you'll need to know. Remember that when you're testing myotomes, the goal is to test maximal muscle contraction for greater than five seconds in order to test the ability of peripheral nerves as well as muscle recruitment. Repeated contractions can also be used in place of long duration maximal contraction. Myotomes starting at C1, cervical rotation, C1, cervical rotation, C2 through C4, shoulder elevation, C2 through C4, shoulder elevation, C5, shoulder abduction, C5, shoulder abduction, C5 and C6, elbow flexion, C5, C6, elbow flexion. You can also test C6 through wrist extension, C6, wrist extension, C7, elbow extension or wrist flexion, C7, elbow extension or wrist flexion. C8, thumb extension, C8, thumb extension. T1, finger adduction, T1, finger adduction. L1 to L2, hip flexion, L1 to L2, hip flexion. L3 to L4, knee extension, L3 to L4, knee extension. L4 to L5, ankle dorsiflexion. L4 to L5, ankle dorsiflexion. L5 can be isolated through big toe extension. L5, big toe extension. S1, ankle plantar flexion. S1, ankle plantar flexion. And finally, S2, knee flexion. S2, knee flexion. There are also a few functional myotomes. So you can test L4 to L5 by asking a patient to walk on their heels. L4 to L5, heel walking. You can test S1 by asking a patient to walk on their toes. S1, toe walking. And finally, you can get a good picture of basically the entire lower extremity myotome integrity by asking a patient to perform a straight leg raise. That's it for this episode. As always, the outline will be in the show notes. The next episode, 2.8, will discuss dermatomes. Thank you.